Splash Pad in BG will now be open tomorrow through Friday. All right, let's talk just north of the state line now. And as we said, Amanda, there has been an uptick in COVID cases and COVID patients who are severely sick and have been admitted to ICUs. Yeah, the numbers aren't as high as the numbers that we saw in the spring and winter, but it is trending upwards and that's raising some concerns. Carla Byron is in Monroe with an update from ProMedica Hospital officials with the situation there. Over the last few weeks, ProMedica hospitals in Southeast Michigan started to see a small bump in the number of COVID patients with severe illness and needing ventilators. The positivity rate is also increasing. Those tests that we do in our hospital with patients who have symptoms or have had a high risk exposure was as low as around two to 3%. Um, we're now starting to see those numbers rise close to double digits again. So I think our most recent average for our Michigan hospitals was around 9.7%. In Lenawee County, hospitals have been seeing a higher number of 20 and 30 year olds needing an inpatient stay. And in Monroe County, their trend is a little bit older population. So I would say 65 and older is what they're seeing, which is what we saw on the earlier surges in the winter and also in the spring in Michigan. Out of the people who are severely sick with COVID, Dr. Yarrow says 95% or greater of them are unvaccinated or not fully vaccinated. There's also a minority of pediatric cases. Cases. We always say every shot in arm is a shot in the right direction. Um, it's a global pandemic, so it's really an all hands on deck team effort to address this. All right, Carla Byron with that report out of Monroe. K through 12 schools will start up again on Monday, so health officials do have concerns because people will be spending time indoors, they say, and they are preparing for another potential surge this fall. But of course, all fingers are crossed that is yeah, the case. Yeah, yeah. Coffee Quest 419 is back. How you can get involved.